A very good morning to all of you, respected principals, teachers, and all my dear friends. Today, I am here to deliver a speech on the topic, the role of students to make clean India. Among two dreams of Gandhi ji, the quit India and clean India. The first one has already been achieved, but the second one is yet to be achieved. Government has launched many programs such as Clean India Mission, Swachh Bharat Abhiyan, and Ganga Action Plan, etc., to promote cleanliness. But Cleanliness is not just government responsibility. It's our responsibility also to make our India clean. Education can change everything, even one's conscience also. We students are receiving that education. We students are the future of our nation. So yes, we have that much courage, that much strength to bring changes, to bring positive changes which will make India a free country, free from all evil and dirt. Make sure that no one shall litter and your waste goes at right place. Reuse and recycle the thing. Plant more trees. These all are the small acts which will lead to greater significance. But there is one question. The word clean. What does this word actually mean? Is it just mean clean to our surroundings, preventing our surroundings from pollution? No. Cleanliness means purity. Purity in all things. Purity in our heart. Purity in our mind. And when that will happen, then definitely our India become a clean India. Corruption is an irreversible damage caused to our society, posing danger to our society not directly but indirectly. I am not saying that we should do something big to make our India clean. No, we do not need to do something very big. But being a student, we should take a little step, a little step towards change, a little step by acquiring knowledge. By acquiring education in such a way which leads to that positive change which we want to see in our clean India. A little step by raising voice against every social evil. A little step by fighting against every wrong act or incident. By spreading awareness among people about cleanliness and sanitation. Clean India, Green India is the vision we must strive for. Cleanliness is not our choice, it's our duty. It's time to clean up our act and make India a shining example of cleanliness. India is our mother India. It's a big diversified family with different culture. But unified always, that's our nature. Himalayas saves us from cold air masses. Indian Ocean serves us lovely bridge. We might find ourselves sometime, but never lose bond anytime. With this, I'm ending my speech. Thank you.